Uh, second question. You mentioned Dusty earlier. <laughs> when, you, when, you, when you put it like that, Duck, it's hard to agree not. But... And Damo, I want your uh, your uh, opinion here as well. So Dusty Martin, we saw you say Mitch Cleary for Channel 7 tried to doorstop him. <laughs> yeah. Dusty just gave the full-on don't argue as good as we've ever seen. No comment. Is he obliged to speak when he's doorstopped? Is he obliged to no. say anything? No, he's not. <laughs> no. Nah. Damo, what's your view on this? Look, I take the view no, Joey. I think it, it's it, – to me – it doesn't hurt the individual to just go, sorry, Mitch, I can't, or sorry, whoever it is, I can't talk, or I'm not going to talk today. I expect you what you do. But to just do it, just to not look the way he did, I don't, it's not a great look, but you know what? Dusty would not give one yeah. hoot and <laughs> care for what it looks like. And I've, I've experienced that with Dusty too in a, in a formal life when I was having a camera at times, and we were at the airport one day. when it, the, the, the day he was going to the Sydney to go and have the interview with GWS, he gave me no at the airport. So oh, that's how he does it. He does it so well. Can all, you can always the, – the problem with it, and people don't understand, that he, he's obviously well sought after – and, he, and the guy's emotional, and he's got a lot going on. He's just injured himself. He's had an up-and-down year. He's had a very, you know, tumultuous year with, with his father and everything else. And and just even driving up and seeing it, Jerno, and it's not about – Mitch should understand it's not about him. Yeah. I don't think Mitch should have an issue with it. No, yeah. he shouldn't take it personally because it's not directed at him. It's just as soon as Dusty would have seen anyone for that well, matter – Well, we've all been doorstopped, haven't he we? Would have been, a bit he, would have been neg- he would have been negative straight away yeah. and thought, oh, I can't believe this, and bang. So – you know what? I, door stopping. It's a natural reaction. We've all been door stopped, haven't we? And your natural reaction is to, no, I don't want it. Because now, generally it's in a negative situation if you're getting yeah. door stopped. You don't want to engage in it and give them give them anything. Mitch Cleary door stopped me on the way. I went up to Sydney when I had my sore ankle to see a surgeon. <laughs> and somehow he got wind that I was, I'd snuck off to Fiji. I was about to. And I hadn't told the footy club this at the time. I just thought I'd dick, uh, duck away for me four days. And he stopped me at the airport. And this is the time when Damo was the number one uh, man in the media. I remember. I remember this, yeah. Paul Mitch uh, stopped me and I said, sent the work experience kid, did they? Where's Barrett? Probably at Essendon and just walked off. I think you tweeted that as well after you did. I did. I took a photo of him and said, sent the work experience kid. So, Paul Mitch. I don't know about door stops. Uh, what about followed overseas? On your yeah, you have, haven't you? Yeah, oh, boy. I had Tom Tony, Branch. Tony Jones followed you. Yeah, he did. Yeah, Tony did. He and, did. and you agreed to a sit-down interview with was, him, didn't you? I was, uh, yeah, I was, I was followed and not found. <laughs> I, I had Tom Brown try and doorstop me when I did my hamstring and whether I was going to play again. I could see Tom Brown through the window across the road waiting out the front of a cafe. So I rang the cafe and said, can you send out Tom Brown a coffee and say, oh, hang on. And I went out the back door, went for a walk. He never saw me. So One of the journos uh, once put a koala suit on him, but he, was, he wasn't sitting at a gum tree. He was sitting at a different... I said, mate, koalas don't eat those leaves. I know you're... A... <laughs> what are you talking about? What, what, what is this a gag? Is that a no. gag? No. Is that a joke, duck, or is that... <laughs> we'll call it that bit. Call it that bit from the show. Yeah, of course we will. <laughs> Has anyone ever put a koala suit on? Out no, front of your head? no, duck. Oh, they have for me. Oh, Maybe fashion that into a jumping out of a bin one, I reckon. No, no, they put a koala suit on. <laughs>